welcome and thanks for watching. Today we got the opportunity to pick up one of these Taurus GX4. Now, this gun has been cleared before the video. I uh, just wanted to make a note of that. And uh, pretty nice little constructed pistol. Pretty small. Uh, the only thing I would like to see, and I, I, I think the, uh, I was reading in there, you can get an extended, uh, magazine for this and uh, holds another round or two, I think too. So, uh, my pinky's dropping right down in it, but no, not bad, not bad overall. But now we're going to show you some of the things you get with this. Now, right out of the box, you get two 11 round magazines. And you get your manual and your paperwork. Tells a lot about the little pistol. You get two back straps. And they're exchangeable for your little pistol. One's on there, and here's the other one. And your little breakdown tool. Oh, cool looking little pistol keychain. And uh, you just put that right in there. We'll show you in a minute here because we're going to take this down. But. We're going to read off some of this about the little pistol in here. And in the manual, it says the caliber, 9 millimeter, and single axle only, capacity 11 plus 1. The barrel length, 3.06 inches. Overall length, 6.05 inches. Uh, the overall height, 4.30 inches. Overall width of the pistol, the thickness is one inch, and the weight with empty magazines is 18.5 ounces. Now, the frame and our, the sights are both steel sights, they're not the polymer or plastic, they are steel. Uh, adjustable back sight is what it says, but you know, you can knock them over left and right. So, you can adjust them a little bit. Okay, and uh, frame stainless steel alloy slide and steel barrel stainless. Uh, the barrel is stainless steel, black DLC coated, and grips are polymer. The, basically, the bottom frame is polymer. And uh, a pretty nice little pistol overall. Now, the takedown on this, uh, simply all you do, snap, and then just take your little tool, and right here, I hope you can see that, you just put that in there, and turn, and the slide just slides right off. So, now, the inside of this, I kind of looked at that. Uh, I like this. They're not just pieces here and there, it kind of goes all the way down. Most of it is like this, you know, has uh, a piece here and a piece here for your slide. And, but these go all the way down. So I kind of like that. And it looks to be stainless steel and made real well in there. Now, I, I do like this. Your slide tension spring no plastic or polymer, all steel. And that barrel is, uh, that's nice. Nice little barrel on that and the rifles. It's good and deep in there. Uh, uh, they're saying these little pistols shoot real well and perform real well. And we're gonna find out because we're gonna take it out to the range. And now I put a lot of rounds to it. So now when you're putting this back on, you don't have to have your tool. When you simply push, it automatically engages it and locks it back down. Just when you push back a little bit. Now, this trigger is got a pretty nice little crisp trigger pull. Now we're gonna show you this. I wanna show you the Right there, that broke, and there's the trigger. We'll do that one more time. There's the break. So there's not a lot of take up on that, huh? 
I'm liking the way the little pistol looks now. Uh, and they're saying they perform well. And like I say, we're going to find out because we are going to take this out there and, and put some rounds to it and see how the little pistol does and how that performs for accuracy and reliability. And uh, so, guys, I thought I would bring this to you and tell you a little bit about it. And as always, we appreciate you watching. We thank you for all those views and comments. And subscribe to our channel so you don't miss anything. And give us a big thumbs up at the end of the video if you like it. It seems to help. And we'll see you all the next time on The Walk for Thou. Out at the range. We appreciate y'all. Thanks for watching.